converging lenses optical instruments like camera microscopes binoculars telescopes etc have drastically widening an all view of the world eye glasses are used by millions of people to read and see and comfort have you ever wondered to which optical component makes all these possible it is simply a lens A lens is a piece of a transparent material bounded by two surfaces of which at least one is curved. A lens bound by two spherical surfaces bulging outwards is called a biconvex or simply a convex lens. It is thicker in the middle than near the edges. A lens bound by two spherical surfaces curved inwards is called biconcave or concave lens. It is thinner in the middle than at the edges. Let us understand the terms related to these lenses. The central point of a lens is called its optical center. It is usually represented by the letter O. For these lenses, convex or concave, each surface forms a part of a sphere. Straight line passing through the optical center in the centers of these spheres is called the principal axis of the lens. Of principal axis is perpendicular to the surfaces of the lens. This effective diameter of a spherical lens is called the aperture. Aperture means the amount of light passes through the lens. Let us understand a basic refraction of light through a convex lens. A convex lens may be an arrangement of number of portions of a triangular prism with a very small glass slab at the center. The base of each prism points towards the principal axis of the lens. Thus, after refraction through the lens, they converge to point of principal axis on the other side of the lens. This point is called the focal point or principal focus of the lens. Let us now see how they form images for different position of objects. A convex lens forms images of varying organizers in nature locations.